If you guys want to have a custom crosshair like in this clip, be sure to stick around and watch the full tutorial so that I can show you how to get it. Alright, what is up everyone? My name is Nerdy, and today I'm going to show you how to get this custom crosshair that I showed you in the clip. So, first things first, you're going to want to go to Roblox, and you're going to open file location. Once you've done that, you're going to see that there is actually two Robloxes. There's Roblox Studio, and there's Roblox Player. Now, be sure that you have the um, latest ro version of Roblox, just to make sure, so that it actually... Um, you actually put in the right version of the game that you're playing. We're going to open up file location on Roblox. As you can see right here, you've got all of these. What you're going to do is you're going to go to content, textures. And as you can see, there is a folder inside of textures that's called cursors. You're going to want to open that. And then you're going to go to keyboard and mouse. And as you can see, you're going to have all of these three cursors. Except that this one, I've already changed it, but it's like uh, it's the cursor that you see me moving right here. And what you're going to want to do is I'm going to go to my desktop because I have a folder where I have, a, where I have the actual cross that I want to change. But treat this as if this one was just regular, all right? So you're going to want to find a crosser that you want to download. I'll probably leave this one in the description below if you guys want. This is my favorite crosshair by far. I use it in Kovacs, I use it in every game where I have to change my crosshair. Love it. But yeah, as you can see, you have these three cursors. You're going to want to change arrow for cursor.png. It's going to be this one. I've already changed it. But as you can see right here, you're just going to want to download your crosshair. And you're going to rename it to this. After that, once you've done that, I like to have a, I like to have this folder on my desktop so that every time Roblox updates, I can just drag it instantly. And once you've done that, you're going to want to go ahead and drag it. It's going to say there's the destination already has a file called arrowfarkers.png. You're going to want to replace the file and the destination. And as you can see, you now have your crosshair. It's called arrowfarkerser. You have it already. I'm going to show it to you in the game now. All right, so once you're in the menu now, be sure to do this in the menu. But as you can see right here, our, cross, our crosshair is already in the menu. It's already moving. But we want it to be at the center of our screen, though. So what you're going to do is you want to press F9. As you can see, it's going to pull up the developer console. And what you're going to do is you're going to resize it to be as tiny as possible. And you're going to put it at the very bottom of your screen so that you can make, so they make sure that it is not blocking your entire screen because you don't want it. We don't want to see this at all. So now... You've basically done everything. You can just literally spawn in the game. And as you can see, you have your crosshair right here. And this applies for everything. It, it goes on top of your red dot. It goes on top of everything. And if you don't like it, all you can do is simply press F9. And as you can see, I'm back to my default bad business crosshair. And then when I press it back, as you can see, it's already there. You can do this with any image you want as long as it's uh, the proper size and I really like this because you don't have to spend 129 robux on a game pass which nobody really has for a free to play game to be honest especially since the custom crosshairs don't even overlap your red dot like this and I really like how it does that I'm not the one who discovered this though angry aimer did I'll be sure to leave his video down in the description below go give him some credit because He's the one who uploaded this tutorial for Arsenal, though. I'm the one re-uploading it for Bad Business because since uh, Bifron removed like the custom crosshairs for Bad Business, I feel like I had to upload this video. Since it's an actually legal way without using a program in order to get a custom crosshair in Roblox. And I really like this because you don't have to download any software or anything that's going to tamper with the game. You can literally just do it within Roblox. It's really nice and you can't even see like developer console at all you can literally just use your crosshair without any problems at all and i really like how it is because it just helps me kind of aim easier where i should put my crosshair yeah that's about it for this video though i'll be leaving my crosshair down in the description below in case you want to download it and i'll also be leaving my discord server down in the description below if you guys have any trouble with uh installing it with uh if you have any questions about it, if it's bannable, which I will be mentioning. But yeah, 
that's really about it. You're gonna be seeing me use this in a lot in my videos because I don't know. I just really like how it turns out, and I definitely recommend it that you do it as well. But yeah, that's about it for this video. I will be. I'll try to upload more. I'm really sorry that I let you guys uh, uh, without a video for a month. That's my bad. I'm, I'm, I want to apologize for that. And that's pretty much about it. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. I hope this helps. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.